सेल्फ मेड पी सी इट इज वेली फन एंड द हार्डेस्ट जॉब ऑफ मेकिंग होम मेड पी सी इज टू मेक ए इम्प्रेशन विथ आयरन रियली ए मैटर ऑफ पेशेंस राइट सो टू सॉल्व ऑल दोस प्रॉब्लम इन टू डेज वीडियो यू विल सी हाउ टू मेक पी सी विदाउट आयरन विद दैट हाउ टू पेस्ट ऑल द मार्क्स इन पी सी टेस्ट इन ए वेरी सिंपल वे सो डोंट वेस्ट एनी मोर टाइम लेट्स डू इट This video is sponsored by JLC PCB. It is better to say here, JLC PCB is a really beautiful PC making board app company, where always you will get excellent benefit when you order your PCB. JLC PCB always take care of customer. Like you can live chat any time for any inconvenience. Even you can choose any PCB color for free of cost. There are also many benefits such as SMT service, stain seal, PCB panel, gold plate, so on. To take advantage of all those opportunity. Today, upload your graph file by visiting the Jels PCB website for few dollars. And definitely, I need a PCB design to make a PCB. For that, I made a design. Then I have to print it with a laser printer, and I will use photo paper here because in this paper you will get a good enough result for this kind of work. And look at what it looks like after it is printed. And then I will cut the bottom and top layer from this paper. Next, I am going to use this type of copper plate here to make my PCB. It is pretty good. I cut as much I need it from here. Next, I decide to use nail polish remover to take impression here. You can use any company's nail polish remover for this purpose. And after that, I will stack the photo paper upside on this copper plate. And definitely, you need to spread nail polish remover top on this board. And remember, there is no need to give too much liquid. And after that, I will put it in a book for a right pressure. And after 10 minutes later, when I pull it out of the book. The paper had stuck properly with this board, and when I remove it, see how nicely imprinted here on this board, as I expected. Then I needed a pot, and I must pour some water into it. And next, you have to wash this board very well with a brush. And after cleaning this board, it look like not bad, right? For etching process, I am going to use a ferric chloride acid here, which is very popular for making PCB. Here I will pour half the water into a cup, and which I will put back in the previous container. Then I need to mix three spoons ferric chloride acid in this water. When it is completely mixed, I will dip the PCB into the ferric chloride acid. You have to move this PCB in water for a while. After running like this for a while, like five minutes, you will see that the remaining copper part of your board have vanished. Only your traces are still okay, and definitely you have to pick the board from this acid. And your final PCB was done properly. See, this is your final result. It does not look too bad, right? And after that, I will remove the black traces spot on this PCB with thinner. See now, really awesome. Which, if I done with the iron, might not be so good. Am I right? And after that, I will make all the holes in this PCB through my press drill. And now it's time to add top silks and bottom solder marks. I will remove the solder point from the bottom solder mark paper with a sharp knife so that my solder point are exposed. Then I will drill three holes in the top and bottom papers in the same place, and stuck with the PCB with the pin. And you know, guys, you have to do it again as we did before. I think this process of making PCB is advanced enough to make at home, at least for me. This is 200 watt amplifier board, which is very easy to make and also small in size. Wait for next video to see how well it works. This was today's short video. If you don't like this video, then you can dislike this video. And if you like it, like this. And don't forget to subscribe my channel. See you again in the next video.